Hi guys, guess what? Yes, I did it again. Sony broadcast camera. I am now officially an order of them because uh, I got rid of a few of them just a few months or weeks ago. And here is another one. And guess what? It is a model I already have. But it was super mega cheap on eBay, just 10 euros with everything. Minus the battery box that I did uh, put a spare one from my stock, but it was complete with a uh, fender lens and just 10 euros plus uh, 6 for uh, low cost domestic shipping, so it was really a bargain. And yes, I took it. I have no idea of what I will do with this one. It was a little bit dirty, but it did clean really well. About the condition, we have the usual suspects. Missing uh, foam on the microphone. Bad delaminating infrared filter in the front. And messed up tape drive, as always. And missing rubber cup for the viewfinder. So the camera part is working. Not too bad, actually. But the uh, tape drive is messed up, to, so we will have a look at it. So I do not really have a tape to test, but anyways, the tape drive will not even open. So if I power it on, after a few seconds, it will drop a warning code. Here we are. So this high pitch noise you are hearing actually is an alarm signal you can adjust here. And here we have a self-diagnostic switch. I did move to the right and now it is displaying error codes. We have a slack warning apparently, but the tape drive is doing nothing. I cannot even open it. So it is quite weird. And if I press reset, we will scroll in a number of uh, either counters or uh, error codes. Maybe there is a service manual somewhere that will tell what it is all about. This one is uh, flickering between uh, 1100 and 1101. And there is a number of them. As you can see, not much here, and then we go to hexadecimal, and back to the starting one. Here we have uh, old style mercury uh, hour meter, and apart from this, it is all the uh, camera part is working pretty uh, well. Not sure how it will show on camera, but it is doing its work. The viewfinder is uh, crisp and the, light, the lens is uh, working well, no scratch. The only problem, of course, will be your delaminating infrared filter here in the front. But every one of these cameras have this problem, so uh, as you can see here, Yes, there is some kind of, uh, yes, here yeah, you can see the delamination between the layers. And I did search for uh, replacement infrared filters, but new, they are just impossible to get at a reasonable price. I mean, uh, hopefully it is not uh, making too big of a mark in the picture, but Still, it is not good. And the lens is a regular Canon. This one. I believe I have a teardown of the same one already on my channel. But this one is really in a decent condition. No complaints here. In particular, for 10 euros a wall lot, it was really a nice deal. Okay. So, now I have to find where I will put this in storage and it will be quite difficult. So, thanks for watching. Bye bye.